Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Bros Forever YouTube channel. And now it's a storm day in city of Eden. So we will play Steve Skyline 3. Let's play series. So let's jump in the game. We are in the center of the city in a roundabout around it and our city looks beautiful there is a botanic garden here our elementary school our high school and our grand hotel is here and so on we will build new or industry specialized industry and i find out there's a place for ore industry right over here this place is suitable for ore industry so i want to build an ore industry right over here because this area is mostly valuable for ore industry so i will build it I will build one of it right over here. So let's start building. I will crush these buildings, all buildings here, because I have to. And I want to use that oil zone to my purpose. And like this, let's crush these ones these are low density areas so it's not a big problem for us we will build it later I want to build an ore industry right over here and uh, there's something here alright let's build And I want to build like this. Alright, nice. Let's build an ore industry right over in the middle of the that area this area is more valuable for all industry alright let's see now we have a road tool nice so let's build an ore industry right over here. I want to build like this right over here. All right. A driving let's advisory build. has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. Second Moon Radio with like your this. host, J. Thomas Hornbuckle. Tune in tomorrow for a second chance to hear the music of yesteryear. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Clinton. But apparently that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual rewards enjoyed. For example, right, consider capital. Like right, well, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? 
By certain metrics, perhaps, yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect nice. on the human Thank body. you, Professor. It is a question of continue. priority. Like that size. We're we're live um, and we're getting reports about a traffic accident uh, somewhere uh, in the city. Road maintenance services have already been dispatched and traffic flow should return this to normal. Area is more but if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you uh, you already know about it. No use reminding you. Meanwhile, expect delays and drive safe. All right, now our ore industry is starting to build some ore. And here I want to build another city. Let's crush these ones too. These ones. Let's raise a road here to the right edge of the here, and that road will be separated our land. And here, one road will be nice that size. I think Ellie is uh, okay from here. Alright, let's build an Ellie. Alright, not bad. Not bad at all. Let's build some trees. Right over here. That's okay. So, our ore industry started. Let's see our production. Now we are... We will start building some ore. Now we are 45 ton producing metal ore. Maybe stone. Alright, we are 71 ton producing metal ore. It's 47 ton. 2 ton right now. We are exporting. Alright, not bad. Not bad at all. So how many people working here? 30. 30 people in metal ore. Nice. And I think if I check natural resources right over here, other site also is suitable for ore industry. Let me jump other site right over here let's build an pedestrian street I want to move in. But it's not possible. Because there's a train line here. So let's move like this. I want to move uh, here under the tram line. 
that size. Alright, let's move like this. Natural resources. So I will build a ore zone right over here. Maybe I have to build like this. Right over here. 90 degrees. And I will build an ore industry in the middle of the, under the bridge. Like this. Let's build. But it's not possible under under the ore industry under the okay let's build like this so I will move like this I will follow the road I want to use that side of the building that side will be another ore industry so I will keep building like this so let's check our production or production let's see okay we are exporting 18 tons so our money budget will be better Okay, it's down. Let's see how it will affect our monthly balance. Twenty ton is okay. We are in plus anyway, so we will earn more money. So that's good for our industry. How many people is working here? 16. It's alright. It's alright. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. How many now? 800. It's okay. It's okay. We can produce 46 tons. It's better now. So we can produce crude oil, but it's uh, our next next step. It will be because next milestones. If we big town oil drilling is opening, so we can build uh, petroleum companies. So we have all mining already opened at 7th seventh, seventh milestone, so that's good. Building or industry is good for us. So let's build that area. Let's work on that area a little bit.
like this. Let's build a zone like this. Not bad. So cool. In this episode, we build an ore industry in the middle of the town. So there's no problem because the wind is going that direction. So we are secure for a clean town. And I want to expand in the middle of this area. I want to expand a little bit. So let's jump in the game like this. I want to expand that side like this. Will be nice. And I want to with the direction but this area is not suitable let's block that area it's not quality one let's terraform the area Like this. Pending updates to our power grid, the city will be in experiencing corner, rolling blackouts. I will build we urge this the public one. to remain calm during these breaks in service and, and to follow the guidelines on the city's website on housing. how to plan for these temporary events. That side. This has been a local public service announcement. Local authorities are urging the public to conserve water and reduce the burden on the city during this, this water too. shortage. Yeah. Consider installing All a right, low flush toilet, our cut back town. on watering the lawn, and nice. shower with a friend Our town possible. expanding. This it's I think high public service rent because you're listening to Second Moon Radio with J. Thomas Hornbuckle, and we're pervading some of the finest classical music on the All air. Right. Keep that dial right here. Our industry and to demand our main is feature story. too much. The commercial district is booming as the area is attracting more high-end stores bringing oh, the latest in luxury to our neighborhood you can now shop for building? designer shoes while sipping a fancy local java mate or so my wife tells me that's good for business and good for the community thanks Jim. what's that really long thing the leader of the city services division is with us in the studio today to talk about why they're contracting with outside agencies to provide vital services for our residents. So Isn't how that are going production? to be costly, Mr. Councilman? Oh, well, quite frankly, yes. It is an additional expense, but the residents have come to expect a certain level of services. I think we are missing uh, we simply do not have the capacity some livestock, to within the so city. because of Sounds our like we are the ones who will end up paying down. for it. Should we be worried? Maybe not. I season. expect the residents would be more distressed if key services became unavailable. Their quality of life is very important to them. But so is their money. We'll be back after this. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Nice, nicely done. So we are building in the middle of the area, that area. It will be nice. Our city looks not bad, not so ugly, it's okay. Our farm area is here. Maybe I can build more chicken farm here. That size. Let's build a road. That direction. And I want to go that direction right here. Let's build a chicken area here. I think I can build this one. This one is okay. More fertile land. episode so that's nice and next episode uh, I think I will build a train train line next episode around here somewhere or here I want to build a tra train line but for today I want to expand my development points for college I want to unlock college then university we will unlock so let's build a college in the town I think best suitable location is somewhere in the town maybe here but these buildings is good levels so let's check our building levels I think they are really good maybe here somewhere I will build our college okay let's build a college 
somewhere in the town. This location is nice, I think, for college. Yeah. It's a good view. So let's build a college in the middle of the town. That side is good. Alright, we build, build our college. It looks good. And I want to expand college library right over here. Maybe back side. Let's put it back side. Alright, that's better. A nice view to the forestry area. A nice village site. Here there's a castle ruins. And I want to keep that area. It's not built area. This is a natural area I want to keep. And let's see. So how many students arrived for the college? Let's see. There is four employees. 94% efficiency. And there are four students. It's alright. Okay, we are losing a little bit money now. What we make some production. So that's okay. We can build more chicken zones because we are deficit in that area. But we are earning really good ore. So that's nice. What about other industries? Stone mining. Hmm. We can build stones somewhere. But I want oil drilling right over here. This area has natural resources oil. That area. Okay, I built oil zone. So I will crush these ones and I will build an oil zone here soon. I will crush these ones. So it's okay for now I can continue like this so that's okay so guys thanks for watching we expand our ore industry next to the town a little bit and we expand here our city so it's okay thanks for watching guys let's end up the, our episode next to the ore industry Let's end up the video like this. Our ore industry is working on. So that's nice. Thanks for watching. See you next episode. Bye bye.